good morning and welcome to today's upload. My name is Emma Sigaran for hauls and vlogs and chats. And if you are coming to me for an inspiration and pack away Christmas stuff, I'm leave because this is not going to be inspirational. This is going to be what it is every year a slightly frazzled, exhausted mother trying to shove decorations into boxes hoping that they fit. That's what we do here. That's what we do. Because I am a mother that had a child um, on the 4th of January, so I have to get things down quick to put up decorations tomorrow. It's fun. Uh, if you haven't seen um, my boy's birthday post, go onto Instagram because it will be up by now. The big 10 tomorrow when you started watching, and I don't know if any of you did start watching then, he had just turned one. In fact, he hadn't even turned one. He, he literally, I started the blog and then a few days later he turned one. <gasps> so yeah, frazzled. The hair's up. I'm actually even going to put on a, um, some eye, <laughs> eye, what they're called, eye mask things while I do it. I'm multitasking. So, um, I will insert a few clips in a bit because I actually took down the tree last night with Stephen. We, we came back from Butlins. Hope you check that vlog out and if you haven't, go and check it out. We came back from Butlins and then we felt inspiration to take the tree down. So that's what we did last night. Um, I have just tidied the kids' bedrooms. I tidied my bedroom. The washing's on. I've run out of washing um, the tablets and stuff. I don't think this has ever happened in my adult life. This bit of hair here is summing up how frazzled I am. I don't think it's ever happened in my adult life. So Stephen, who's at work now, because I'm with the kids, he's going to go and get some later. So then we'll do some more washing. So the drying's on from the one washing tablet I had left. And I'm going to tackle the following two things and you're going to help me. Um, so watch all my unpack with me, the Christmas tree and everything, and then come back for the bits you've got to tackle today. So behold me taking down my decorations in my peacock's dressing gown that was actually gifted to me. It is the world's fluffy dressing gown. So if they've still got them in store, make sure you've got them. Also, Emma has got spot cream on her face. And yes, I am talking about myself in the third person for some reason. I took down the kind of more precious decorations first, the ones that we've got from theme parks, the ones that I've got from Shop Disney. And do be mindful if you're getting these kind of decorations from Disney, they can smash. I have got a Peter Pan with no arm, I've got a Tinkerbell with no legs, and a Chippendale where their ears have fallen off. So just be really mindful. I kind of set them aside because I'm going to wrap them up nicely. And if you are transporting them from the parks, especially if you're coming from like Florida, wrap them up in a towel, wrap them up in a sock, keep them in your hand luggage because they are very, very easy to break. I then took down the kind of cheaper Primark decorations, which aren't quite so breakable, to pop in the plastic storage box that we've got. I just use a normal bog standard storage box. The blanket that I wrapped the precious decorations in is my first Christmas blanket, and I think it might have been my boy's first Christmas blanket. I like to hold on to things like that. So yeah, put all the nice precious decorations in there so it's all nice and wrapped up. And then make sure I say to Stephen, be careful with this box. Talking of Stephen, here he is. He unwraps the lights, that's his job. I decorate, he unwraps the lights. This is how our relationship works. And please do check out our wonderful storage box. Yes, it's a cardboard box. The cardboard box, the tree came in 15 years ago with just a vast amount of masking tape on. Margot is disgusted. Next, I went to polish all our shelves, get rid of any glitter, any little bits of Christmas tree that are on there. Do you polish? I use Pledge or Mr. Sheen. And whenever I talk about this on my Instagram, people are like, we don't do that. We don't polish. What do you do then? I also polished my fireplace and I'm sorting out my plants and I am gonna do a video in a couple of weeks where I chat about plants, probably in a vlog. So if you have any questions, definitely ask me. I have a lot of plants. I need to do a, a count. And also you'll see later on in the video, I actually have a lot of empty plant pots. And you know what empty plant pots need? They need filling with more plants. Oh, where's she gone? She's gone off for a little walk and what's she gonna come back with? Oh yes, lovely, it's another plant. I love it! This is gonna be one of the first big things. Somebody keeps getting messages. I think it's um, my dad <laughs> messaging my little boy on his tablet. Um, this is gonna come down today. 
what are we gonna do with it guys are we gonna do a disney thing theme what are we gonna do all this has to come down and i have to decide what i want to go in 2023 what i want to have disney theme should i get the valentine stuff out i don't know what to do so we're gonna do that that's gonna take ages the, oh, the other thing hello margo happy new year to you say hello to your fans your friends your followers what's your message for the new year fascinating if you hear the um kids watching telly in there so i the first thing i'm going to do now is take all these my beautiful tiny houses which are gorgeous they're gorgeous they're the loves of my life they're my favorite things if they would focus in but they're also so fragile there is no way i could just shove them in a box each individual one has to go in each individual box i've got two three four five one, two, three, four, five, six, seven to put away. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's eight. And there's only seven boxes. I do tend to keep this one out year round, so maybe that's why. So that's the first job. This is going to take me absolute ages. So each one, each one comes in a polystyrene box, which is also fairly impossible to get out of the cardboard box. And then you have to try and work out how to get it in nice and safely but if you are thinking of getting a max one somebody messaged me and said there's some in the sale now so definitely go and check that out but two do bear in mind i've had things snap off i've had to super glue numerous bits and bobs on so they are a very very fragile thing to own so you have to have enough room to shove the things in the boxes it's a whole it's a whole big deal i have just noticed on my third one there's the top bit and then the, underneath there's the bottom bit this is going to make life a lot easier and then you, um, some of them, I've got this Velcro thing so you wrap it out round to make it even more secure. Um, this is, oh do you know why am I standing up doing this? I could just sit down and doing it. Right, we've got five to go, five to go. Hooray Margo and I, you were no help actually, you were no help. Margo and I have got all the houses in the boxes, um, these are all the other decorations and the deal was if I got everything down, Stephen would then move them up because we go up two flights of stairs but I think I probably will keep these two out along with my Halloween Mickey in my office anyway like a little little Disney delight um, I'm now going to kind of wrap the little figures in the snow and put them in a bag because they're quite delicate as well and put the trees away and then I need to brush all this off there's a there's um, a box somewhere upstairs, I'm not sure where it is, I might have to do that later, where there's all pictures and stuff that go here, usually, and all these plants here need to be moved as well, so that'll be my next little job. Before I clean all those shelves and the table, I'm going to clean everything at the end. I'm actually, I've got this bag with a bit of room in, so I'm going to put all the kind of non-breakable stuff in that, so that will take up a little less room i am so concerned where i'm going to put these mugs it's going to be fine guys we're going to do it but all stuff like this can go in this plastic bag that, that, that it won't break it'll be fine it'll be fine it'll be fine she tells herself repeatedly i've given everything a nice clean down with my method multi-service surface what sm smell is it is it lavender fresh lavender oh, because i need some relaxation so i'm going to do i'm going to go through my plants I'm going to put the plants back up and try and work out where the pictures are so i'm going to go through them um make sure they're all nice and healthy pull off any bits that aren't doing well and then i can put those back up there until i can work out where the rest of the stuff is so that is my goal for now i will do a video in a couple of weeks focusing more on plants because i do plan on buying a couple a couple kind of have not survived the winter um, even though it's still winter some have thrived so I will definitely do a little bit of a video but these are crazy so I'm going to sort my little plants out now okay we're getting back to normal I've cleaned everything I've swapped the Christmas candle for a strawberry pound cake like spring candle the plants are up there ready for what the picture there's pictures that goes there and there and some photos and stuff that's ready this let me know in the comments what I can do with it I can't I think it's happy. I can't tell if it should be up more. Maybe I need, I need to have a little Google, but that can be in my plan. That is not a today problem. This one, however, is the craziest. This is just like the biggest. 
I think it's the combination of being in the light and maybe by the radiator. It just makes it grow so much. So this room's nice. I'm just now going to go, ignore that. <laughs> I'm now going to start on this and work out what I'm going to do. I think my plan is, so if we look in, has this got one? Yeah, if we look here, I will take mugs out of like this place and put mugs back in there. I have quite a lot of can these canisters, these radon canisters. So what I think I might do is turn them all around, clean them, turn them all around, and I think I'll actually put them all on the top there just for some more room. Um, so it'll look nice because it'll all be white there, but that, I think that's my plan. And I'm going to go through the mugs and really see if there's any I can donate or if I want to keep them all. Uh, so that is the next plan. I'm a lady with a plan. Can we tell I'm losing my mind? Can we tell I'm losing my mind? It's because it's because we go from in this house Halloween is September. I know I'm not complaining because I love it and it's me. We go from Halloween September the first, two months Christmas, two months, then Ethan's birthday. So it's like four months of loads of stuff just being in the house. So it's just a bit of a deep clean, get a Mac together. That's what I got to do. And I know that when I put it up. I think, I think I really need to go through all my Christmas boxes and sort them out. Um, that's not a today problem. That's, that's, that's probably an Emma problem on November the 1st. And when I do this video on November the 1st, I'll be like, I really should have gone through all these. And you'll be like, you said that flipping 10 months ago. So, right, let's sort these mugs. Whoa. I've got all the Christmas. Mugs out. I've separated them into like Disney, Ray Dunn, Kath Kids, and Miscellaneous. And then I've gone over here and I, sorry, every time you come over here, you see my washing, but we're drying stuff in. <laughs> we're drying, we're drying washing. Um, and with each thing, I'm going to pull off the paper and give it a good clean. And then I sort of make the mug magic. Ugh, it's a lot of work, but. It'll be nice when it's done. I'm, I'm just a woman, surrounded by mugs. Finishing off the heroes, wondering, why do I have so many mugs? I'm just a woman, literally, just wondering, why do I have so many mugs? I do love mugs. And I just don't know what to do with it. I think I might just put them in and then over the next few weeks, sort it out. Because the aim of the game today is get everything tidied so I can put Ethan's decorations up. That's the aim of the game today. The aim of the game today is not to make the best mug display in the history of the world, which we all know I could do. We all know I could do that. I'm going to have a few more heroes, listen to my podcast, take my time. She's going in deep with sorting. I have got don't be thinking these are all new candles. These are not. I change my candles seasonally. There are many older candles, candles here, but I did get two for Christmas. I got the Pick and Mix and I got the Caramel Crunch and some um, other ones that I've had. I think I got Coral Peony for my birthday, actually. Rainbow Shake. We've got Strawberry Lemon Ice. These are from because I keep them. Uh, and I've took the labels off those, those annoyingly. But I think that would be like a cotton one. So I keep these, uh, so I put the Christmas ones away and then I get the summer ones out. So I've got this ready for the next couple of months. There are all my diffuser oils. This is a really nice candle. This is quite an old one at Bath and Body Works. Uh, that actually got shipped from America last year or the year before, a vanilla cola candy. It's very nice. So these are all like summer, spring. These will take me through to my autumn candles. I really like sugary scented candles. So um, these are all great. Sugary or floral, anything like that are my faves. You start out putting your Christmas decorations, you move on to organizing your candles and now I'm organizing plant pots. <laughs> I'm organizing my plant pots in for a penny and for a pound. In for a penny, in for a plant pot. Um, I'm thrilled. My 
dining room is looking very spring-like and pretty. I know January is still winter, but I am thrilled. I am, however, worried a bit, bit, bit worried about this plant. I'm not going back to the plant. I've already talked about that. We're going to do the whole of the video. Reverse, reverse. Going back to the plant pots here. I'm going back to them. This is unacceptable. <laughs> I've got so many plant pots because people buy them for presents, which is fab. Um, I need to start repotting some of my plants. I've got some that are propagating that could go in these little ones. Like, this is an adorable little one. So I'm going to have a little look through these, see if there's any I can donate. Well, there definitely will be. This is where I keep them, clean all this. I'm going to think I'm going to have the vases on the top for all the millions of bouquets of flowers I have. Guys, oh, the amount of bouquets that I've, like, sometimes I'm like, stop sending me so many flowers. Literally, I get flowers twice a year, but I like to buy myself flowers. So I'm going to put the um, vases on the top and then the plant pots on the bottom, I think. That is the plan. Hooray! So I've got plant pots on the bottom and then vases on the top lots of plant pots and plant pots they all need filling don't they guys I've got this big one off my mom so i definitely need a big plant for that but yeah they're all that's all nice and clean cleaned all that out very pleased i think i'm done for now i think i've done for now the kids are back to school tomorrow um so i'm gonna do some more tidying and stuff tomorrow but the mugs are done the mugs are done um this isn't that how it's going to stay, but it'll do for the moment. We've just got it's all nice and clean. I cleaned it all out. Uh, we've got Ray Dunn, Kath Kidson, Disney, then my own mugs, and then some Emma Bridgewater mugs and um, a little Valentine's mug, but not perfect. Actually, it looks all right, doesn't it? It's not perfect, but it's fine for now. Um, I didn't actually have to get rid of that many. I got rid of a couple. I donated a couple. And then um, in here, we just have, she's, Margot, come on, get, you're gonna help me. Say hello to your friends. Here, we've just got the, oh, that looks nice, isn't it? Give it all a good vacuum, all a good clean. Um, as I said, I'm gonna go, and when Stevens comes back, I'm gonna find all the stuff that goes there. I don't know where to put it. I'll put it somewhere safe, and I need to get that out to put all that up. Uh, and then this has to go upstairs, but Stephen can help with that. I am going to go up now, and I'm going to um, sort those. I'm going to take the Mickey and the Minnie up, so that's one thing that can go up. Maybe I'll see if I can get the kids to help bring some of the stuff up as well. They're just enjoying their last day of the winter holiday. So there we go, my lovely friends. That's my little... You know, not aspirational, just getting it done and all. That's not a word. Uh, video today, got it all tidied, well most of it tidied. Um, the bedrooms and I'm actually gonna go, once I've, I'm gonna take Mickey Minnie up and then gonna vacuum upstairs. Uh, I took the kids' trees down. Still not got any washing tablets. So that's it, in the coming weeks I'm gonna be doing a few kind of organisational videos. My office is an absolute state and I've got some new organisation bits and bobs. Obviously I've got my wrap and paper box, so I'm gonna sort that out. So 2023 is gonna be really fun on this channel because we're going to be doing um, some house stuff, which I will talk about more in the next video, so I'm really excited. Steve and I have got lots of plans for the house. Really looking forward to doing some of the rooms and some little projects, kind of two quite big projects and then um, some others that are a bit more, not what, not de not decorative, what would the word be? Where you decorate. Decorative. A couple of decorative projects. So I will chat more about that in the next video and of course we'll get you know go and doing some shop with me and hauls and all that good stuff and also we have a couple of wonderful trips booked right my lovely friends i'm off to go and move a mickey and a mini upstairs to their new home um i love you lots and i will see you very soon for another upload 